All right, so you see the resemblance? <laughs> <laughs> this is the wife of Mr. Allen. Could you introduce yourself? I'm Alice Allen. Okay. Well, it's nice to have you here. Oh, nice. And from what you've told us, you knew each other before Mr. Allen shipped off to the war. We went to high school together. Okay. And how long were you together before he left? Well, we went together in the 10th grade, and we graduated from high school in 1947. Then I went to college, and I taught school. Mm -hmm. While he was gone. Mm -hmm. So how was it when he left? What was that like? Did you give him a hard time? <laughs> no, I remember we brought him to Syracuse. He left from here. Uh -huh. <laughs> was it hard to say goodbye to him? Yeah. What did you know about the Korean War or, or anything? Did, did you know what kind of what he was getting into? Or I guess he shipped off to the Mediterranean before the war. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I went into the military in 1948, mm -hmm. and, the, and the Korean War didn't start until right. 1950. Uh -huh. So I, I, we were extended for one year, but yeah. And you guys were able to keep in touch throughout mm -hmm. through letters. Used to write. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. And so he. You were home a few times. Yeah. 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 Okay. So he told you about his, I guess, easy action in the Mediterranean and then <laughs> the switch right. to, the, right. to Korea. Yeah. Yeah. Was that kind of scary for you? Probably. Yeah. How was teaching while he was over there? What was that like? Good. Yeah. It kept her busy. Yeah. It kept her busy. Kept it's, your mind off. I went to college three years, so I got... I was teaching two years before I came home. Mm -hmm. yeah. And so what was it like when he finally came home? Great. <laughs> yeah, why? Just to have him back? Yeah, well, let's see. You came home in the spring and we got married this summer. Mm -hmm. So you didn't waste any time. <laughs> right. <laughs> you didn't want to let him go again, right? Yeah. <laughs> was it scary yeah. when he came back with his... With his arm and, and the leg? Did you? It was, you probably didn't get home for quite a while. Oh, that's true. That's true. But the only thing I had was the first three fingers. I found out that there's a different nerve that controls these and another one that controls these. You wouldn't know this if you didn't know that I'd had an operation on it. Mm -hmm. and, uh, so, so I'm, I'm left-handed anyhow, so that made it easier. Yeah, that's, that's true. <laughs> so, how do you f feel about this project? You know, we're, we're inviting the veterans in here to tell us about their experiences. And of course, we'd like to hear about the experiences of their family and how, you know, the war impacted you and, and everybody. Just to, give it a, to let future generations know, to have more information about the Korean War. Right. So, what are your feelings about this whole project and, and how you are now participating in it and your husband is participating? Yeah, I think it's good. Yeah. Why? Well, different ones, but the young ones will know more about it. Young soldiers or young or even people? even our own children. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And did, throughout the years, did you have you know, your husband, he said that it took him a, a little while to open up and mm -hmm. express those experiences. Were you a part of that? How was it like when he finally started to open up? I guess I didn't know it that much either. Mm -hmm. Do you remember when I called? Yeah, we were already in Syracuse, weren't we? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because we first lived in Binghamton. So it was after we came up here, I think, that you called. Yeah. It was in the paper when they had the, there was a fundraiser for Chosen Few or something. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was an interesting phone call, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so what was it like to hear about his experiences and learn? Because I guess you didn't really know. No, I didn't know. What was that like to learn about that? It was... It's kind of scary or...? Well, it was good to hear about it. Yeah. Did it seem like he wanted to 
discuss it, or was he kind of reluctant to share his feelings? I guess he finally did, right? I can remember, well, that's true, but it was a long while I was home before we started talking about it, right? Yeah. Yeah. So is, is there anything that you can tell us about how, I guess, Mr. Allen coming back, how that impacted your relationship and your family's relationship? Do you think, you know, his experience over there changed anything for the better or for worse? No, I don't think so. I guess we were older. Mm -hmm. That's about all. We lived in a, in a small town. And uh, coming home was an experience, wasn't it? Mm -hmm. Okay. Um, so, what's it like now that he's talking about it and you know, he's, he's received this great. She's, yeah, she's going to say, I talk too much. He talks too much about it now? <laughs> So at first he didn't talk about it, and now. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. Well, thank you for coming up here and talking to us. Well, thank you.